Sad East governors know what to do to release Mazin Namdekalo. Prophet Ebukobi have told them what to do in order way to release Mazin Namdekalo immediately. <laughs> they say one woman don't cry, come outside though. The way DSS take a beat up in husband and tag him. Um, uh, he said the husband and all those guys where they do yawu yawu <laughs> things are happening hmm. they say the road where the governor of uh, abia state built for home are here hmm. seren don't carry on komoto <laughs> no be smarting hello my wonderful people welcome back to balabas gs if today is the first time you are coming across this wonderful channel you are highly welcome ebeni kwezioku hmm if today now your first time and you know say you never subscribe to this channel wait till you the wait here will they bring them back to back up there that's the heart and don't forget to turn your notification bell so that anytime we will upload you will be the first person to get them hmm? things are really happening let's go and look into the Ogbenge news we will get for a hand today hmm. they said the prophet will be able to be don't call the sad east governors they then say may they do something now to the this mass in nam de carlo that the rain that are about to fall will fall on the Igbo side we be say go fall for sad east in yata yata say the reason mass in nam de carlo is going to bring more solution to waiting the apple for the country now so we are going to play you the video for you to watch while we'll come back we'll continue i have letters i have wrote to anambra take our boy he must tell all of them our lawyers are going to submit it to them that if they want the interest of the people the whole south eastern governors knows what to do you cannot quench fire with fire dialogue is the way out and one of the things they should do is to come together and go to federal government kneel down beg whatever if they love a leader should be a servant a leader is a servant they know that what they will do that can bring peace now is to negotiate how much now the canal will be released and we lift our hand up here we pray for his divine release amen because i know that is one of the things that will bring peace I am coming from the angle of peace. If we continue like this, nobody will travel. Everybody is afraid of traveling. So I'm also begging the federal government to no good share. So far, the court has give, asked him to go. Federal High Court. And he should be released. Our most of our leaders does not have the interests of the people at heart. Most of our problems are not federal government. Do you know that every month your governors receive billions? What are they doing with it in Ebola? The northern governors are more active than eastern governors. Every month, eastern governors receive allocation money, billions. Where do they beat company? Where is the company? That is why every average Ebola man must leave Ebola. Because there is nowhere they can walk. No walk. So the reason for migration, but I want international airport working in Ebola. There is no seaport. Even though that our people are the most traveling race in the whole world. But there is no international airport. No seaport. That is why people are migrating back out. Then our governors are not also helping the issue. Because if they are using their location money, putting things in the state, people will not. Be, if you go to our land, it will be a CV, it's a desert. If 60% of Igbo Indians are outside Igbo land. When I see people saying that uh, Christianity is our problem, I will, I will be asking myself, this people do they reason at all? The best hospital in Anambra State is owned by a church. Our ladies in here. One of the things is the church leaders, your government. Every, every city is developed by government. Dubai is a pure Muslim country. It's developed by government. America government, UK government. Instead of you to hold your government ransom, you are talking about Christianity. What has religion has to do with the building of the road? Electricity. Good hospital. These are necessities that government provides everywhere in the world. Where they are we pray for Nigeria. 
and we pray for Igbo land that let this rain flow to Igbo land. Amen. All these people killing their own brothers and sisters, may heaven begin to remove them. Amen. If Welcome back, my people. As I have watched that video, hmm, no be smart, you know, things are really happening as we are talking. Um, the release of Mazina and the Carlo is truly really going to bring a solution to South East. We are be shouting and uh, talking about this particular thing, but the government don't want to hear. They think it bo um, bullet and gun can solve this particular problem, but the answer is no. <laughs> Let's go to Maya and look into the road where we say the current government. Governor uh, for Abia State, they beat for Omaha. Uh, may we go play the video? May you watch them by yourself. I see that they complain, say the road, what are they carrying and they come out. Governor Ali Suti, I am highly disappointed in you. Upon voting in the Aini Gunu Mahi, the Penosan Seno Grand Seno Gozo. We do see Satra, Emenani, Emenani Gota, we do bamboo stick. We see Satra, Emenani Gota. The Penosan Seno Gaseno Ganoma, you have a bama fees too. You have a bama road, no more, the Penosan Seno Ga. Eh? Yeah, we know we are Maligan looking by the general in Hatch. Yeah, we are Maligan Lucis. I'm very disappointed in you. Only she nigger here. Yeah, we should now to Kuno, only she nigger here. No, sir, you know, sir. Yes, that road is currently in uh, Omaha, built by Governor Alex Otto. <laughs> Things are really happening as you see them. They say what that they carry them, they come out. The one where they face the guy pass, he saying use bamboo stick, they put for the gota. Now bamboo stick will go hold the gota for them. <laughs> Things are really happening. Um, our people are construction. This one is uh, uh, in my village construction. <laughs> Things are really happening. Let's go and look into the woman we cry come aside he said the dss brutalize your husband beat and water water call him yahoo boy say your husband where they work for international organization say the man no do anything no the inside car now the DSS gone carry and beat her, call her attack on the beggar. <laughs> they say where the home is in the car, everybody tell them say the reason. They say no, they no go the reason. And this is what people are passing through in their hand. Let's play the video for you to watch. My husband is not a Yahoo boy. My husband works for an organization, an international organization, which he is an expatriate to them. My husband went to Ethiopian embassy to re, uh, pick up his visa. Why he was waiting in the car, he was working on his laptop. DSS men came there, collected the laptop, collected his phone, started beating him and took him away. Getting to his office, they asked for his ID card. He brought out his ID card and showed them. They brought him back to the um, Ethiopian consul, consul, consulates. When they brought him there, the people asked him, ah, where did you go to? He said he was, um, that he was beaten. All his face is swollen. DSS officer, uh, men are not begging. That um, they thought he, that, that they, are, they, are, they are fighting case of terrorism. DSS said they are fighting case of terrorism. They beat up my husband now. I am using this media to call those in power. Those in the, in the DSS head office. Those who control the boys, see what your boys are doing. Your boys are at, uh, beating my husband up. They are beating him up. Uh, he, 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 he's managing his health. Oh. He went to pick up his visa. Oh. He went to pick up his visa. DSS overall, your boys went to Ethiopian embassy. My husband was in the car responding to mails. Your boys pick him, jack him inside, blue, inside moto. Carry his laptop, carry his phone, go to the office, undress him, undress him, blow him, all his face don't swell up. Look at his laptop, he's not a Yahoo boy. They brought him back to embassy. They said that uh, 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 Ethiopian uh, 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 consulants was like, this is inhuman. This is inhuman, your boys are begging. My husband cannot breathe, oh. My husband cannot breathe, oh. I cannot let you there alone, no. Oh. Whoever is DSS head, you didn't hear my voice, so your boys went to embassy to pick my husband. DSS head of officials, your boys went to embassy, Ethiopian embassy, pick him inside the car, started beating him. Even if you pick a criminal, won't you do investigation? Won't you do investigation before you beat them? 
He they pick him inside the vehicle where he was waiting to go in for his visa. Started beating him. Took him to their office. They say it's a mistake. Your boss says it's a mistake. Your boss says it's a mistake. That they are fighting terrorism. They are thinking it's terrorism. We carry laptop. No investigation. You started beating a, a 60 year old man. Your boy started beating a 60 year old man. DSS head of official is that to do the job. If you catch criminal, you will not, you will not confirm before you start killing him. My husband was at DSS office, Abu Ethiopian eh, 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 embassy, Abuja. He's a man that tell you where he's going to. Ethiopian office, Abuja. That's where he deal. He's at Ethiopian embassy to pick his visa. To pick visa. He's inside the car waiting because they are not open to customer yet. Your boys brought him out of car, put him in moto, started beating him. That is terrorism. That they are they are fighting terrorism. They started beating him. He's bleeding. You know? My husband make you not die, yo. Make my husband not die, yo. I don't talk my own. I cannot trade children alone, no. I cannot trade the children alone, no. I'm calling DSS head of official. My husband cannot breathe, no. He's at Abuja. He's at Ethiopia uh, 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 Airline, no. My husband is at Ethiopia Airline, not in, uh, in hotel in Yahoo, Yahoo. My husband cannot breathe, no. I'm calling all of you now. My husband is at Ethiopia Airline, he cannot breathe, no. My husband not feel brito. He's 60 years old. He never managed to out. Your boys don't use gun. Breaking chest. Oh. And they call on an hour. And they will not carry plenty of dead body. Who will not carry plenty of dead body. DSS official. Now they are begging him. There is a mistake of identity. He cannot brito. My husband cannot brito. I don't tell on an hour. My husband is at Ethiopian airline. He went to pick his visa. They mistake him for terrorism. He wear, he wear, he wear kafari. He wear, he wear abada. They are beating my husband at, at Ethiopian airline, no. He cannot breathe, oh. Me, I'm in New York. My husband cannot breathe, oh. There's an officer. Go and, go and carry him to hospital, oh. I cannot trust you there alone. Where's in the use is the work? Even if you confirm I'm a robber, would you, would you get fat? Would you get fat? Small small boys can't go break break on your chest. Make sure I don't kill my husband though. I don't turn on my own. My children small. My children small. My children small. He went to pick his visa. My husband went to pick his visa at DSS office. Eh, hey, Ethiopian airline. Yeah, my people, welcome back. As in Nigeria, don't happen to this particular woman. Now they cry, come aside. If they tell them, say, no pray, man, Nigeria or DSS happen to you, they no go believe. Right now, it don't happen to Ram. And the woman, they cry for help, saying, husband, do not be a boy, yo. And saying, be the work for one organization. And they don't search, they don't see anything for that man. They call it a con, they beg him. <laughs> see how things are happening in this country when unprofessional people are working it's very very easy to detect them because they are not trained for that particular work they paid to join the work this is what is going on <laughs> things are really happening um my people now so we we'll see more and i will say more bring and come give on a beg may you know forget to share this video and uh, also um subscribe to this channel and leave your own opinion and contribution for comment section let's talk about it you know as they go now <laughs> okay we'll see you for the next update thank you